Hey everyone, I'm Josh Benson. And I'm Melanie Michael. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. We begin with Tico Energy. It provides utilities for thousands in the Bay Area, and soon it will be under new ownership. Aid on your side wants to know if this will mean higher rates for you. News Channel 8's Chip Osowski live for us tonight at Tico headquarters in Tampa. Chip, what is the answer? How are residents going to be affected, and will they? Well, the simple answer is no, they will not be affected. The deal still has to be approved by federal regulators, and if they give it, give it the nod, Canadian-based EMRA will officially own Tampa Electric. In July, Tico announced it was exploring strategic alternatives. Friday afternoon, EMRA announced uh, also, the proposed uh, deal. Tico Energy will become a new wholly-owned subsidiary of EMRA uh, in a $10 billion transaction, which we expect to close uh, around the third quarter of 2016. According to Amera President and CEO Chris Huskelson, it could bring additional jobs to the Tampa area. So there's not one single uh, part of this transaction that is, that is about job losses. That, that it, the, the transaction is not based on that at all. The transaction is based on bringing two very strong companies together to make an even stronger company and to create more growth. TICO representatives tell us base rates will remain unchanged until 2018. Fuel costs are based on the current market value. Huskelson says the cost of the acquisition will not be passed on to customers. We will commit to the federal agency that, that none of the premium or the merger costs will go into customer rates. That will be a commitment that's made uh, that we expect to make in a regulatory forum. Antico serves 700,000 customers in West Central Florida. It also has operations in New Mexico. Those New Mexico operations are also included in this deal. Mel? All right, a very big deal tonight. Chip Osaski reporting live in Tampa. Yep. Thank you, Chip.